right, here we are, Crater Lake. Now, this is my second time here, and it every time I come up here, as my second time, it completely blows my mind. And who do we have here? Hey, say hi. Hi. <laughs> you guys probably remember her. This is Bobby. She's coming up and visiting me here. So was it was it worth coming up here? Yes, it was. <laughs> <laughs> this is one of the most beautiful places on earth that I know of. So we're having a little snack right now. Lunch, a lunch snack. Yeah. What do you What do you think of the food? I like it. Pretty good. Yep. Well, we have a what kind of sandwich. Did you get? I got uh, Italian. Italian. Mm -hmm. Wow. I got a hot dog mm -hmm. with a cob, cob chicken cob salad, a little Caesar, butter. and we've got some other little treats here. Rainbow. Yeah. Oh, I've seen those in a long time. And your yeah, Brownies. that's what I picked. Yeah. Okay. Looking good. What's up, guys? How you doing? Well, we are uh, just pulled into this campground here in the National Forest. It's Abbott Creek Campground. I think this is in the Rogue, the Rogue National Forest. And I thought I would uh, share and show with you guys our campsite and a little bit of a few shots of the uh, surrounding area here. This is actually a really nice campground. I have never been here before. There is no running water. There are pit toilets, trash receptacles. There is a camp host here. Look at the camera. There's a camp host here. It's $14 a night. So, this is our campsite. We're just chilling. We just got the tent set up and got camp set up. There are some primitive outhouses. I thought I would show you guys these outhouses. These are like really old school outhouses. Like they were built in the 1970s, which are really cool. There's this little little trail that goes through the jungle and there are women's and men's pit toilets but they're really cool they're the you know real rugged old uh, rustic built this is the women's gonna knock on it no nope, nobody in there but uh, they're actually very clean 
of a ample supply of toilet paper. But uh, so that's the bathrooms. And we are just getting set up for the night. Um, let's see, we just cracked open a, uh, a beer. <laughs> uh, I pulled the label off of it. This is a Redmond, Oregon beer that tried, and it's actually, uh, pretty tasty. Wild Ride Brew Nut Crusher, Redmond, Oregon. Yeah. So this is it, this is the camp setup. Pretty simple. Got the cooler, got the stove. It's got our food supply in it. We're just uh, doing the mountain house meals. Trying to keep it really simple. This is a cool little uh, cook set, cook stove. Not cook stove, but little cook eatery utensils and stainless steel plates that I picked up at Walmart for like ten dollars. I've never seen this before. Thank you. What what did she say? There's a wasp's nest in the ladies' bathroom. A wasp nest in the ladies' bathroom. I was just in there. Holy moly, I didn't even yeah, I was showing them. I was showing the, showing the YouTubers, the uh, the facilities here, oh. showing them a rustic, kind of 1970s, outhouse. And you didn't spot it. And I didn't spot it. So guys, that's it. We don't have any campfire wood. We're uh, keeping it Fine. keeping it on the low low, and it's it's pretty warm. What how how hot is it here? About eighty degrees. Left 66, yeah. Other than that, we're, uh, we've got a Kelty. This is a Kelty Gunnison 4.1 backpacking tent. Really nice tent. Really happy with it. I bought this about eight years ago, and I've used it about six times. But the more I use it, the more I like it. It has uh, doors on both sides of the tent, so uh, everybody can get in and out of it really easily. And it's got this really killer rain fly on it. Uh, with these Vesta tubes. I don't have it staked off, but uh, it's really nice. It 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 seems to uh, protect, keep uh, keep the rain off. Yeah, I'll get a little bit of a walkabout and show you a few other shots of the surrounding area. We're probably about five or six miles off of Highway 162, which goes into Medford. So we're a little ways back here into the National Forest. But this is a really nice park here. Campground. Abbott Creek Campground. Pretty nice in here, huh? Very beautiful. Lots of large trees. Beekeeper? They're so aggressive here. Yeah, like a beekeeper. The bugs are definitely out. Uh, we're using some 25% DEET, 30% DEET bug spray right now, and it's uh, they don't, give a damn. they don't really give a damn. Yeah, cattle guard. So we're just walking out to the entrance here to this campground, Abbott Creek Campground, not too far, uh, just outside of Prospect, Oregon. Prospect, never been to Prospect, I'm assuming it's probably gold, gold mining, or just mining. So there we go, Rogue River. Yeah, this is a creek. 
nice and lovely. Ooh, nice little swimming hole right down there. That was the water. Very cold. Very cold. Yeah. Ah. Oh yeah, it's not bad at all. It's cold. A little refreshing though. Yep, real nice. We were just saying, uh, put this spot right on your on your radar here. There's no signs saying that you can't camp uh, for the night. No, you know, there's uh, some people down there setting up camp. So, yeah, a great little spot down by the river there. To uh, it's level from the forest floor. Just found this log. Just dragged it out from underneath that tree over there, you know, cleaning up around the campground here. Uh, are you having fun? Yes. <laughs> so what do you have to say about this camping adventure? I love it. You like, uh, how, what do you think of uh, Oregon so far? It's very beautiful. Trees forever. Very beautiful. Think you're going to come back again? Yeah. Okay. Have I been driving you crazy at all? Be honest. Tell everybody. No, you've been a good, good guide. A good guide. Okay. Yeah. Tour guide Ken. Tour guide Ken. Oh, yeah. <laughs> tour guide Ken. Yeah. Because I was tour guide Barbie in San Diego. Yes, you, you were. <laughs> yes, you were. It's payback time. Yes, it's it payback is. time. It is. Campfire, burning some dead wood around the camp uh, campsite. Got my old, uh, my old trusty push-pull camp saw. Got to have one of those. Must have one of those and a small hatchet. Get out there and go camping. Do it right now, okay? Your life depends on it. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> How are you today? Good. How are you? I'm good. Good. Did you sleep good? Yes. It was warm. It was warm. Uh-huh. Okay. Well, it's a beautiful morning here today. Beautiful morning. So, I guess we'll go down and uh, check out the creek today. Okay. Maybe do go bathing in the creek. When it's warmer. When it's warmer? <laughs> yeah. Anything to say? Having fun. Having fun? Yes. Camping rocks? Yes, beautiful. No ground squirrels, though. <laughs> No ground squirrels. Yeah. The mosquitoes are biting pretty good, huh? Yes, that's why I have my hood on. Yeah, the mosquitoes are biting really good. Really good. We're all covered up. Got socks on, long pants, long shirt. Yeah. So, yep, this is camping. Camping in July. Hmm, so I just spotted the water spigot for this park. It does list that there is water at this park, but it's locked off. Uh, I'm not sure. Kind of. There it is, padlocked. It's kind of like an old school pump here, pump type water. It's a pump, hydraulic, it's like a hydraulic pump. Bring your steel 044. And there are some modern style pit toilets available at this park also. Okay, so we are going down to check out the creek again. So the trail to access it is uh, campsite 13. And the trail is just right over here through that little opening there in the fence. Cool. This is awesome. Wow, who would have known, huh? Huh. Oh yeah, nice. Here it is. There's Abbott Creek, look at that. All right, so we're down here, uh, I believe it's Abbott Creek, and I found one swimming hole right here. It's a really deep section, there's Bobby over there. Say hi. Hey. <laughs> That's pretty deep. 
at least uh, knee deep here. Knee deep at this point, a little bit further out there and at least waist deep. So it, it, it is cold, the water here is cold, but it feels really good. It feels really, really, really good. And it doesn't seem to be too buggy down here, but here's another little creek that funnels into this one. Yeah, what a swimming hole. Look at that. It's just all in the center right there in this little uh, little channel right there. That's awesome, huh? Look at that. You can see how deep it is. This is going to be nice. So, yeah, we're going to uh, soap up with uh, some environmentally friendly body soap. Wash up a little bit, I think. We're at another campground here today. This is River... What is it? River Rogue? River Bridge. River Bridge National Forest Campground. Right on the... I think this may be the... I don't know what river. I, I don't want to say the Rogue. It might be. But uh, another nice little swimming hole here. A nice little shelf. It's probably nice and deep right there. But look how beautiful that is. This flows nicely all the way down here uh, through those rapids. There's uh, several people fishing over there. Uh, people riding uh, dirt bikes, ATVs. It's all uh, legal to ride licensed off-road vehicles in this area. We, we got really lucky. This campground, when we skated in, there was about three sites left remaining. And we took one and somebody pulled in right behind us and took the other one. And But it's only $8 a night, which is really cheap. The road coming in here wasn't very good. It was a pretty rough road, a lot of potholes. Uh, but yeah, it's a, it's a nice little primitive, primitive campground. They have pit toilets. There's no running water. We're okay. We're doing videos. What do you think about this little spot? Oh, gotta get away from my license plate. <laughs> what do you think about this little spot here? Very beautiful. We're outside very of Brookings. Beautiful. Brookings, Oregon, right outside. Right out, right off of the Highway 101. Scenic spot. What is it, about 65, about 70, 70 degrees, I think, right now. Temperature's perfect. The wind isn't blowing that bad. Yeah, it's really nice. Wish you guys could all be here. <laughs> okay, you know what? You don't want to be in the camera? Whoops, don't oh, hit your head. <laughs> uh, okay, lots of fun.